Rockstar, get the show on, get paid. Hello, I'm Kirsten Huggins. And I'm Jacob Sloan. Mm -hmm. Welcome to ESMS Student News. Today is October 19th, and we only have 13 more days till Halloween. And here is Shallow with the sports. This is Shallow with the sports. The 7th and 8th football team is going away to Hay Hire. Good luck to our football team on Thursday, October 19th. Bye. Thank you, Shallow, and good luck to our football players. Go Devils. Moving on, we have Sledge with Georgia history. Lyman Hall was an ordained minister, a doctor, and one of the three Georgians to sign the Declaration of Independence. Quite a resume for a man born in Connecticut on this day, 1747. Oh my gosh, I didn't know that, James. Thanks for the information. I'm in mood for a random fact. Okay, Seth, you can tell me the random fact. Did you know that? You have to eat 487 bananas in one sitting to die from a potassium overdose. That's so random. I didn't know that. Well, before we do anything else, I need to know the weather so I can make sure I wore the right clothes. Today's weather will have a high of 80 and a low of 55 with a 0% chance of rain. Thank you, Jada, with the weather. Hey guys, um, we're here for our new segment called Good or Not. I'm Emma. And I'm Anna. And today we're be, we will be trying um, fast food treats and we're going to be rating them if they're good or not. And today we will be trying a cookie butter milkshake from Arby's. So, Arby's has a saying called, um, we have the meats, but today we're not going to be trying meat. We're going to be trying a milkshake, which is really odd, but it's supposed to be cookie and butter flavored. So, let's try it. Because so presentation-wise, it could be a little better because it was in Mr. Todger's freezer, or refrigerator. So, it kind of deflated a little bit because it had whipped cream on top, I can see. So, other than that, it looks pretty good. I can see whatever that is. You see that? It's like brown. It's like, yeah, I think there are brown specks in it. And it has, well, it looks like graham cracker crumbs on top. And it smells like graham crackers. Like graham so crackers I think smell. we're dealing with graham cracker as cookie. Yeah. So let's try it. Uh, that's just the whipped cream. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Okay. Go. It tastes like coffee. It does kind of taste like, like milk coffee. That's good though. It tastes like buttered coffee. If that makes any sense, it tastes like buttered coffee. With um, graham crackers. That's good. You taste marshmallow. It's kind of like a s'more. If you add some chocolate in it, yeah. it will taste just like a s'more with butter in it. It's actually really good though. So I would think you need to try it. And there's big chunks of cookies in it, so. It's not bad. Okay, so, what do you rate it? Yay. I say good. All right, well, that's it for our new segment called Good or Not, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. ESMS um, News would like to encourage students to maintain a healthy, diet and an active lifestyle um remember that fast food should only be consumed um in moderation remember do not try this at home our feet do not try this at home we are fast food professionals well i guess that's the end of the news we'll see you next time thanks for watching esms student news bye, bye. next week october 23rd through 27th is red ribbon week with the theme, your future is key, so stay drug free. Every day of that week, we will be having a dress up day. Monday is say goodnight to drugs, so you can celebrate by wearing your favorite pajamas to school. Sorry, there will be no onesies or other footed pajamas allowed. Good morning, A Street Middle School. This is Dr. Stone, your principal. Hope you're having a great day. I need all students at this time to stop what they're doing and pause for a moment of silence. Thanks, students and teachers. Will everyone please stand for the pledge? 
I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thanks, students and teachers. You may be seated. Students, at A Street Middle School, our expectations each and every day is to be ready, respectful, and responsible. Hope you have a great day.